Hello, I'm Claudia and today we're going to make some very delicious and super easy fish cakes. But before we start, I'm going to wash my hands. So today we've got um, 400 grams of sweet potatoes. Um, I'm using the ones with the white flesh because they are a bit denser than the orange ones. You could use uh, normal potatoes, you could use the orange ones. Um, they have been either roasted in the oven, whole like this, for 45 minutes, or boiled in a bit of water, that's the other option. Then we've got 100 grams of smoked mackerel. I've taken off the skin and I've been very careful to look through to make sure that there aren't any bones. We've got 100 grams of sweet corn. You could use sweet corn, you could use peas, you could use any other vegetable that's pre-cooked. We have two spring onions here chopped, a handful of chopped coriander, but again, it's a bit up to you. You can use parsley, chives, whatever flavors it is that you like the most. And I've got a little bit of lemon zest for the flavor here. You could also use chili or paprika. Um, so again, this has to do with whatever flavors you like to mix with your fish. We've got a little bit of oil for frying and we've got some breadcrumbs. Okay, so the first step is to prepare our base. Our base in, is made up of the potatoes and the fish. We're going to start by peeling and mashing the sweet potatoes. So let's get mashing. Now, all we have to do is add all the rest of the ingredients to our potatoes. We'll start with the fish, in with the fish. So this is our base. Anything that comes after this is sort of optional and really up to you what flavors you like with your fish. Sweet corn. Coriander, a bit of lemon zest, I think it gives it a really nice fresh flavour, and the spring onions. So all we have to do now is mix it very well. a spoon, nice big spoonful, make a little bowl with our hands and then pat them down into a nice thick two centimeter thick patty. And now we're going to coat our fish cakes with some breadcrumbs. you could freeze them if you wanted to keep them for the future they freeze really really well for about a month and then whenever you need them you just need to take them out of the freezer let them out for about 20 minutes and then continue doing what we're going to do next which is frying them great so all we have to do now is fry them we're going to put this at medium heat pour in a little bit of oil to cover the bottom of the pan. And then once it's nice and warm, we'll put a fish case in. Nice and careful. It will take from two to five minutes on each side, depending on how hot the fire is. All we have to do now is turn them over. Look how nice and crunchy. Mmm, 
yummy. And leave them another two to five minutes. And they're ready. Scoop them out. Put them on a plate. And so these are our fish cakes. They are amazing with a the salad. They're really nice in a burger bun, like a burger or in a wrap or simply as a snack just by themselves. If you have something specific that you would like me to cook, please let me know in the comments.